Hi friends, today I am giving a lecture on handshaking property in graph theory. It is one of the important property in graph theory. So in this video, what is handshaking property and how it is satisfied by a particular graph that we are discussed in this video. First of all, what is handshaking property? Suppose we are taking a given graph G. G is equal to B comma E where B is nothing but set of vertices. E is nothing but set of edges. So each and every vertex has a particular degree. Now we have to find out the sum of degrees of all the vertices. So this number must be an even number. This number is equal to the twice the number of edges in the given graph. So this is nothing but handshaking property. The sum of the degrees of all the vertices in a given graph is an even number that number is equal to the twice the number of edges okay so this is called as the handshaking property so here g is equal to b comma e where b is nothing but set of vertices e is nothing but set of edges so sum of the decrease of all the vertices in a given graph is equal to twice the number of edges 2 into mod e is nothing but number of edges. Here small b is nothing but a particular word, vertex. Capital B is nothing but set of vertices. Here capital B is nothing but set of vertices. From the set of vertices we are taking a vertex. For that vertex we have to find out the degree. So in this way we have to sum the we have to add the, all the vertex degrees in the given graph. That number is equal to the twice the number of edges. So then it satisfies the handshaking property. Example, so this is the given graph. So G of B comma E. So capital V is equal to set of vertices V1, V2, V3, V4. Okay, edges mod E is equal to how many number of edges are there? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 edges. Okay, so now degree of V1. Degree of V1 is nothing but how many number of edges incident on the vertex. So this is one edge, this is another edge, this is another edge. So, three edges are incident on vertex V1. So, degree of V1 is equal to 3. Next, degree of V2. So, how many number of edges incident on vertex V2? So, 1, 2, 3. So, degree of V2 is equal to 3. Next, degree of V3. How many number of edges incident on Vertex V3, here this is loop, self loop. Self loop is counted twice. Okay, so this is 2, this is 1, this is 1. So total 4, this is 1, this is 1. Loop is counted twice while calculating the degree. So therefore degree of V3 is equal to 4. Next, degree of V4. So degree of V4 is equal to how many number of edges incident on vertex V4? 1, 2, 3, 4. So 4. So therefore degree of V1 plus degree of V2 plus degree of V3 plus degree of V4 is equal to twice the number of edges. So twice the number of edges. So that is equal to degree of V1 is 3 plus 
degree of V2 is 3 plus degree of V3 is 4 degree of V4 is 4 is equal to 2 into how many number of edges are there? So that is 7. So 14 is equal to 14. So that is true. So this graph satisfies the handshaking property. The given graph G satisfies the handshaking property. Satisfies the handshaking property. Okay. So, this is the description about handshaking property. So, thank you. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please share this video to your friends and classmates. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel name. So, Divvela Srinivasara. Thank you.